Hello, and welcome to this quick video highlighting the Compress Vessel Wizard in Compress. The Vessel Wizard is a tool that will help speed up vessel creation. When Compress is launched, you simply come up to the File menu, and you select the option for Vessel Wizard. When this is done, a dialog will appear, and this dialog has all the inputs necessary to build the vessel. Now a key feature here is in the top right hand corner you can select a default file. So for example instead of entering in information for every job if you know you're doing work for customer A and they you know have a preference for stainless steel vessels versus carbon steel vessels or your shop has preferences for vertical towers versus horizontal vessels you can simply load the defaults in and those defaults will come across every time. So what we can do here is look at the basic design conditions you know we'll just leave them the default the dimensions, so for example the vessel diameter, the tangent to tangent length, and you can even adjust it based on capacity as well. From here you can select your design code, whether we want division 1 or division 2, if the vessel will be horizontal or vertical, things like that. Now I'll go ahead and add some nozzles here as well as the support, and then what you do is you work your way through the dialog. So for example, here's a nozzle, maybe I want to edit this nozzle or add a new one, I can do that. I can save it, maybe that was a default I had from last time, but we can also add nozzles here as well. I'll simply click next, and this is where I would come to my supports page. So notice along the top we have the option of selecting legs, skirt, or lugs. Again, we don't break out modules for our supports, it's all included in one program for you to make it very easy to design these vessels. Now when I click finish, there's my vessel. Now the Vessel Wizard has already gone ahead, we've sized things like vacuum rings, the cylinder thicknesses, um, again this is a vertical vessel but if we had a tall tower, you know, there's a lot of complex things going on with those towers that we're automatically accounting for for you. Now I only put one nozzle on here because the other option you have is to use the quick design mode within Compress. So if I press the F2 function key on my keyboard, I can simply drag and drop my nozzles. So that's another option, you can do the main vessel shell first and then get the nozzles placed on here. Now from here what can we do? Again I can go ahead and help QA out, I can go to my forms menu, I can select my U form, go ahead and automatically fill out my U1A form, or what I can do is come over here and click on my 3D export option and export the solve model. I could then take it to our shop floor welding management software to check to make sure that we have WPSs and welders available for this job, or I can take it out to SolidWorks where our code interface will assist you in creating your drawings automatically. So there's a lot of benefits of using the Vessel Wizard to help streamline and speed up the creation of your vessels as well. So if you're not already taking advantage of it, I suggest you try it out. Or if you're new to Compress and Codeware, give us a call today at um, 941-927-2670.